Good morning, folks. I'm Austin Underwood, and here today we're on the outskirts of Garden City, Kansas, in a marshmallow field. And as you can see, this is the last remaining marshmallows in this year's harvest, and we're running out quickly. With the small, uh, with the scarce amount of marshmallows remaining, prices for producing and buying them in stores are going to skyrocket. Walmart has raised their prices on marshmallows, so we have had to increase the price of Krispies to two dollars per crispy. Here I am with Garden City High School sophomore Jessie Bribiesca on her thoughts of the latest marshmallow drought. I feel like it's very crucial for all of us people that love Rice Krispies. They're very delicious. You know, I just don't feel like it's a very good idea. We need to figure out how to plant more. It's insane. You know, we spend a lot of money on the Buffalo Coffee Shop and for them to just raise their prices like this, it seems unnecessary. I don't know why it's happening. Well, as you can see, marshmallows love to grow from stuff like this. And we're in a giant field, a giant field. And this right here, it's just a little tiny area. That all, This is all the marshmallows we have left. And usually at this time of the year, we still have, I don't know, at least two thirds of this field completely covered, but this is barely a sixteenth of this field. And it's, it's insane how uh, the snow this year has caused such a decrease in the amount of marshmallows that were being produced from this year's harvest. See, like, look at this one right here. Delicious. I think they, they can't have Rice Krispie Treats anymore. If they're going to continue to raise prices as much as they have, they just got to eliminate that altogether. I mean, with the marshmallow crop being what it is this year, there's no way they can sustain this. I think it's tough that the prices did increase, but I mean, it's still for a good cause and a lot of people like the Buffalo Coffee Shop. Are you going to buy Rice Krispies now that they're $2? Probably not. That's very expensive. You heard it here, folks. We need more marshmallows and we need them now. Reporting live from the outskirts of Garden City, Kansas, I'm Austin Underwood from BBS TV.